I just wanted to give you guys a dream I had last night. <clears throat> um, see if it means anything to you. Um, a lot of symbolism in it. I was in a camp um, in the beginning of the dream. And um, there was total chaos erupting. There were people... Um, killing each other, shooting each other. Um, and it was, the chaos seemed to center around um, racism. And uh, it was all in the camp I was in, it was all uh, white people. And this isn't something I think about at all. My, my wife is African American, so a race doesn't even for the most part come into my mind and I live in California where um, white people are a minority so it's really not talked about um, so I don't know why in my dream um, it seemed to be the the big divide between people um, and then somehow in the camp there was, there was suddenly order put in place because there were these there were these people that appeared and in my dream they called them the watchers and um, as soon as they came into it then there was there was suddenly some kind of order and structure and I tried to escape the the camp at some point and I was um, I was brought back in and kind of imprisoned there and I heard in my spirit that the camp um, was the world and I was um, being imprisoned in the world and then um, there was a group of of these people in the camp that started talking about the rapture coming and they started talking about the fact that they knew it was the end and uh, one of them said I know I'm going to hell but we're going to rule in hell we're going to um, we're going to lead the armies of hell um, the guy was one of the one of the people that were called the watchers that that said that and I I wanted to explain to him that um, hell wasn't going to be a place where he would be able to rule and lead um, that it was a place of pure punishment because he didn't seem to grasp what it really meant but before I could tell him that um, the scene changed and I was late for my own wedding um, it was my wife that I was marrying obviously we're already married been married for 11 years but um, but we were getting married again. So I think it was just, she was symbolic of our marriage to Jesus. But I was late for it. And she was late for it. So we were running through the halls to this auditorium where we were going to get married. And, and we opened the door and then we're walking down the aisle. And then the dream's over at that point. So the way I interpreted it, um, it, I mean, it seems pretty self-explanatory to, to me, other than the wedding part, but um, the world, you know, turns to chaos. There's a lot of division and separation, um, and, I, and probably they're going to use race to create some of that. You can already see the beginnings of it um, with things like Black Lives Matter, which is funded by the, by the Clintons. Um, but I think they're they're gonna divide uh, wherever they can divide, whatever ways they can um, divide people, they will, and so that'll probably be one of them. And then um, the the watchers could have been whatever the Antichrist or Satan is gonna like. He'll I'm sure he'll have his own armies that'll be put in place to bring some kind of order or structure to the chaos. And so I think that's what that represented. And I think those people if, don't really understand um, 
they don't they've accepted hell to some degree they don't really understand what that means they've been promised something very different maybe i don't know they're under some kind of delusion i think and then rushing to the wedding i think you know the 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 watchers were talking about the rapture and then it changes to the scene of the wedding and so i think that was the rapture and then um the bride of christ is um getting to marry their groom um jesus christ yeshua and uh and then that's that's the end so it was a it was um a really cool dream uh the only dreams that i really remember anymore are are these dreams that are um that are really symbolic i don't i don't remember any normal dreams anymore so um i kind of it's easy to to figure out which ones are from seem to be from god um because they're the only ones i can remember so anyway um be blessed keep looking up um time short nato just um bombed a, a syrian military base today which I'm sure um, Russia and China will retaliate to that. They're not going to take it laying down. It may not happen right away, but it won't be long. And um, in one of my dreams, Russia was attacking um, just as the rapture happened. So keep looking up. Time's short. Do whatever you can for the kingdom of God. Um, be blessed. Talk to you soon.